Welcome back to American Arms Channel, ladies and gentlemen. This is going to be a quick one. Uh, when we did the original uh, heavy hitter slug load for the 10 gauge by Warwolf Ordnance, I didn't see really great accuracy out of the Gold 10 light and the improved cylinder choke. A lot of times from when I have always known to do is that you typically start with improved cylinder or modified and go from there and usually Foster style or Brennicky style slugs don't normally like a full choke, but they can. Um, I didn't have enough and enough time that day to really provide a, a lot of shooting with the slug, and I only have four of them left. Now, I'm only going to try and use three today, but what Warwolf did was they commented on the video and they said that the load was developed with a double barrel Spanish made 10 gauge. So, we're going to take a look today. Well, due to nuts falling on the roof of the enclosure, as well as a lot of traffic on this range day, I decided I would narrate this portion. So we're using the left barrel and the rear trigger of this shotgun, and it does have a mid-bead, so I'm able to use the mid-bead as kind of like a rear sight on the shotgun. And although that did work out well, it's not the most precise method of aiming, of course. You notice here that recoil is definitely stout, but not as bad as the monstrous two and a half ounce turkey and buckshot loads that I've put together and Warwolf offers. Accuracy is moderately better, uh, measurably better in fact over the Gold 10 light and I will blame the size of the spread primarily on me and the sighting system of the gun. I think further testing is needed and I think the gold 10 light with a red dot and a full choke on it will definitely need to be tested. I'm just going to take the time now to comment on the quality and overall performance of Warwolf's ammunition for the 10 gauge. Honestly, you're not going to find any other manufacturer that offers this unless you're hand loading yourself. And really, it is some fantastic stuff, extremely high quality, very effective. Really, you just need to grab a box and pattern it or accuracy test it yourself. Even though I am struggling a little bit with these slugs and I need to get another box for further testing, it's really just going to come down to fine tuning. I think once you figure out what these slugs like as far as choke and, uh, of course, adding an optic to make it run right, I really think it's going to come together. So, guys, if you're interested, go check them out at worldfordinance.com. And as always, God bless, keep your powder dry. I'll see you in the next video.